out, guys. The tree that's going to the state capitol is here in our little town of Murphy. It was uh, harvested from the uh, National Forest in North Carolina. How long, how long is it? 73 foot tree. And as you can tell, people in our town came out in droves. Everybody's signing their name on the banner for Christmas. That's a cool truck too. Look how streamlined it is, sitting down low to the ground with the air ride. Came out of Texas. It's got a Christmas tree on the dashboard. Skirted down low. So this is a pretty cool thing. We don't get this too often. I've never had a chance to see it in person in my life, so it's cool to see it here in my little town. Let's go take a look at it. Seventy-three feet. Look the fake woods. <laughs> How are you? I got. There's a bear. <laughs> so this is a piece that's cut from the tree. So 1950s when it started growing. Follow this all the way out. 2022. And here's some of his little babies. <laughs> there it goes. It's on the way up to Cherokee. And from there, you'll have a total of 13 stops in North Carolina. And then that 73 foot tree, 102 foot long truck and trailer. And that's going to make its way up. Out to Manio, which is its farthest point in North Carolina from here. And then from there into Virginia for two more stops and then off to DC. service guys and he says they have a team of, of uh, forest rangers that go ahead of the truck and take down stop signs and, and street signs to make sure that they can make their, their turns because the trailer is so long as you see he's pretty tight right now but he's got plenty of room left turns aren't a problem it's the right turns he's got to worry about So here it is, mostly sunny and about 75, 80 degrees today. And it won't be long before that thing's sitting in the cold lawn of the White House, lighting it up for the Christmas celebration.